Welcome. In this video, we will discuss C data types. Before going to this, we are also mentioning that it helps in TCS smart hiring for BSc and BCA. And we are also conducting 10 mock tests from 25th December 2018 to 4th, 4th January 2019. And the reason is 5th January 2019, we, we have TCS smart hiring for BSc and BCA exam. So if you take 10 mock tests, 50 to 65 percent of the questions are coming in the main examination. Coming to the C data types, data types in a C refer to an extensive system used for declaring variables or functions of different types. The type of a variable determines how much space it occupies in storage and how the bit pattern stored in interrupted. The types of C can be classified as follows basic data types, enumerated data types and derived data types. So regarding basic data types, they are arithmetic types and are further classified into integer types and floating point types. So coming to the integer types, the following table provides the details of standard integer types with their storage sizes and value ranges type storage size and value range character one byte of storage and minus 128 to 127 or 0 to 255 unsigned character one byte it takes the value range from 0 to 255 signed character it also takes one byte of storage and minus 128 to 127 integer takes two to four bytes mm. Integer takes only two two bytes minus thirty two minus thirty two thousand seven hundred sixty eight to thirty two thousand seven hundred sixty seven. Unsigned integer it takes two bytes of memory zero to sixty five thousand five hundred thirty five. Short two bytes. Unsigned short also two bytes. Long takes four bytes minus two one forty seven four eighty three six forty eight to to 147, 483, 647. And flow, um, coming to the float point types, here we have two things, float and double. Float takes four bytes, double takes eight bytes, and long double takes 10 bytes of memory. And they are occupy, um, the value range is 1.2e minus 38 to 3.4e plus 38. It takes six decimal places. Double will take 15 decimal places. Long double takes 19 decimal places. And white type. The white test specifies that no value is available. It is used in three kinds of situations. Function returns as wide. There are various functions in, in C which do not return any value or you can say that they return wide. A function with no return value has the return type as wide. For example, wide exist int status. Function arguments as wide. There are various functions in C which do not accept any parameter. A function with no parameter can accept a wide. For example, int y rand of wide. Point is too wide. A pointer of type wide star represents the address of an object but not its type. For example, a memory allocation function wide star malloc size t returns a pointer to wide which can be casted to any data type. Enumerated data types. They are again arithmetic types and they are used to define variables that can only assign certain discrete integer values throughout the program. Enum Using enum and type dev, we are creating enumerated data types. Like um, Janu January to December, we need to represent with 0 to 1 to 12 numbers. Weekdays, Sunday to Saturday, 0 to 6 numbers we are indicated with using enumerated data types. And derived data types, they contain pointer, pointer types, array types, structure types, union types, and function types. Derived data types are constructed with the help of basic data types. Pointer means 
it holds the it is a variable to hold the address of the another variable array is a homogeneous collection of data structure is a heterogeneous head structures and units are heterogeneous collection of data function is a set of instruction to solve a problem thank you